Hello there and welcome back to Strategic Command World War II War in Europe as we continue our fight to the last bullet against Allies on expert difficulty level with all bonuses maxed as we are, after all, trying to restore the borders of the Roman Empire itself. It's been a couple of weird turns for us with the high pressure on the, let's put it, a group, army center group. We have suffered many losses in this sector. Actually, I'm pretty sure it was quite heavy in the losses. Not that heavy. I would... Yeah, that is the term. Quite heavy on the losses. By... Committed by the Soviets themselves, of course. Hopefully we can manage a little bit more quite soon. Let's take a look at Soviet losses. It should also be significant. Yes, it is. It is. Let's continue with that trend to grind them down but we are getting a little bit closer too close to my liking to the 110% threshold a British suck so that's good Americans are not doing anything yet effectively but we see a lot more ships coming through yeah so we'll have to keep that a mindful eye on that. Command and control cannot be finished anytime sooner. And we're getting some much needed improvements as the Italians. That might have been a bit of a silly mistake. I should have probably gone for logistics. I am still thinking about that. That's the only thing that I'm thinking currently about going for logistics because we will need those HQs. And I'm keep, keep I'm just keeping thinking about naval weaponry being relatively close to being finished. So, you know what? Let's leave it as it is, shall we? Tunis may fall next turn. I would hope that will be the case, but who knows? And we would be left with only, only one more country to be liberated from the presence of the Brits. Well, infidels, let's put it that way. Let's go to the turn, another summer turn of 1942, August 1942. Mm -hmm. Brazil declares war on Germany. Okay. Never weaponry level 2. Nice. Sweden route has been. Is still being raided. Yeah. Nice income. Let's keep growing. Now to the oil fields of my cop. They retreat, hopefully, also this HQ is outside of range. Good, good, move out. Yeah, lose the pressure. Another one of those. Wow, okay. That I didn't expect. Soviets are still uh, resisting. But I think we reinforce and we just move away. Leave one unit in Voronezh. And just pounce whatever we face. And we secure the flank in the salient, Bryansk salient, instead. Of course you are.
Nice! Finally some good performance. And I don't know what that was meant to be, but... Fine. Dig in, dig in. This has to die. Beautiful! I always knew I could have semi-counted on you. Of course you do. I know, I know. Technically he can escape. Beautiful! Anti-tank for the win. Three points. Hold the ground. He cannot defeat us. Beautiful! He will spend a time to re, re Hold. We can cut his ass. Cut his ass off. Perfor perform that nicely. As long as you can. Beautiful free star hero. Stay. Bye bye. Hold. That should be worthy. Yes. Whatever we can start, bastard. He went in. Easy kill. Potentially. Yes. Oh no. Here they go again. This up here for once, can you? You should be like at zero supply. You haven't moved at all. Yeah. Die. 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 We'll have to survive that one. For now. The Red Orchestra espionage group is broken up in Berlin. I think Italians can suffer a few MPP of losses. For a bit of a time. North Atlantic. German security unit. Now let's play raiding activities. Significant substance of loss. So where are they? Up north. It's not looking as good as I was hoping for. We have to attack from this X. From the marshes we suffer penalties. Not you. Yeah. Apparently. But let's go to the high seas. We know that they might be somewhere. I'm still looking for them. They might approach from this side, however. That's also something we need to keep in mind. Anti-aircraft defense, because carriers will pounce us if it comes to that. We have you. Now let's take a look at your capability. Okay, we'll need to spend you too. Oh no. Please. Well, he won't resupply at least. Just to be sure. Let him suffer. Ugh. Not something I enjoy particularly, but never open read done. What next? I mean we could we could go for that. That should be done. 
yeah, let's do it. Maybe one day we'll be able to actually spend that money. Now. Of course you do. So why are you so weak? No HQ probably, that's why. Now I don't want you to die by accident. So I will leave you where you are. If only, right? Unreal. There will be something. Nice reaction. Hopefully it will be done. And you can free my unit. Now, Shalsk and, and friends. Okay, so as we can see, the attachment is lacking. Which obviously we cannot have. Look at that, that's beautiful. You will now... Let's deal with Finland first though. We'll deal with that at this time necessary. My West, dedicated to the West HQ, is going to leave. Because we need to, as it seems. And he's going to sit in this hex, actually. In the hex of Rostov. To provide magnificent supply our mighty units which means you don't need attachments but you will be attached and you will be attached and you were not attached disgusting of course Shalsk where was my medium bomber? you were the medium bomber we need to reinforce let's go to Finland okay because I keep forgetting later about it. That looks fantastic. Sit in this hex. How are we doing here? We continue with our little assaults. Or do we? Yeah. If only, right? Let's move you up. Technically, we can replace you. Next turn. Are you in supply? No. Move you up for now. That's another elite we can put on you, after all. We are going to swap around. Put elites on you to clap him properly. Now this HQ will be redirected. We don't need help anymore. To yes, this hex. Because you'll need to be operated somewhere as well. To help us out achieve our goals and dreams. Now what does it mean for us in the Italian front line? 
we'll have to keep and see. Now, that should be a cutoff of this guy. They want to test some stuff. Mm -hmm. That should be sufficient to finish him off. So let's swap instead around. Put an elite on you. Nice capture. And that should be a cutoff of this guy. Good enough supply. And we'll see how you will enjoy our presence next step. We need to prepare them all for a long war. Of attrition, that is, of course. Now, from Tallinn, we should have range with our medium bombers to leech all the way to Leningrad. And by medium bombers, I mean you, of course. Let's leave you at 10 supply. You will no longer be needed in here. That should have fallen. It didn't, because we suck. As per usual, but still. Hold the line, hold the line, hold the line, and move up to Tehran. He will sit in there for quite some time, I would assume. Four, three, two, three, two, one. Let's take some of those locations. Technically, if I do that, I cannot go back, so I'm not going to risk it. But I do not expect it to survive a slaughter from my tank. An onslaught. Anyway, Italians are good in the north. At least they should be. They shouldn't be stopped if our mighty Ariete and Litorio tanks now going forward to destroy the evil. Presence. That should be cut off permanently. Now, what do we have here? Some destruction of the enemy forces. Maybe not certain, but destruction nevertheless. Let's spend this time on reinforcing you. As much as it breaks my heart. And actually you as well. Unreal. To see what would be the best reaction. that advance I don't want to risk dying to that by accident hmm For now that, that will have to suffice. We kind of need a flanking unit in this section. Pretty good. Let's advance to pieces of destruction. That's for supply. Of course he swung the wrong way. But what's new? 
Well, hopefully, what's new is that they will fall for once. And what's new, I hope, as well, will be the fall of this pocket. Now, that should be sufficient. I mean, not fall, but creation of the Bryansk pocket this turn. Which is kind of sketchy. Especially considering the amount of units that we have to flank. Support. But nevertheless, it has to be done. Well, I will say that they should enjoy now the fruits of their work. Let's reinforce you. While we can. In good supply. And then we retreat to Voronezh. 3, 2, 1, 0. Now we guarantee he's not going anywhere. Let's whack you once. Let's whack you twice. Now maybe that's not too smart, but... What can they do, realistically? Let's protect my HQ just in case. That zone of control. That should be done. And dusted. Group Army Center. Job has been completed. Now we need to properly demolish what should have been dead a long time ago. Oh, my dear lord, seriously. Those guys. Anyone in range? <laughs> no. Sucks to be me. leave the remaining one for now. Let's buy Garrison. The last one that we'll have for quite some time. It's time to destroy some stuff. Someone lacks HQ support. To reinforce you properly. No, you still have attachments. Interesting. Okay, that should be much easier now to deal with. Although it might be even that easy that I will not lose my valuable, of course. Resource. is attack. That should be some experience. Nice. That would be great. But you can reach it. You can reach it. You can also reach it. Of course, not lucky enough. No way! Of course, you're there. 
Let's continue to smother them. Good. Nice. Bye bye. Another one bites the dust. I'm going to leave you because we don't know what's going to happen there. Morozovsk looks like a likely candidate to go down next. Mm -hmm. Who else do we have? In proper range. Please die. Okay. We'll need to retreat with you, actually. Believe it or not. Because we need to, to su some support from the army. In this group. Speaking of which... Let's try to demolish Morozovsk. How are you doing? Pretty great. Bombers deployed. Anyone without losses? Yes. Look at that. You can actually do something. Bye. So we've got that still. Not anymore. Move up. I'm not going to... That's messy. Now you are not in a good supply situation. Hopefully they will go on their own. Abandon their madness plans. Means you can reinforce. Oh, look at that. You can attack. Let's not waste a good attack, shall we? After all, this is a medium bomber, you can stay a little bit further. Kantemirovka, we will be able to move on soon. But for now, that we'll have to do. Of course, you're next on the list. I will even swap you around to, make, to guarantee that might be the case. So we move further, we are on the verge of my cop first. August 30. We will continue our march to victory. There will be no stopping us. Please tell me we don't have, yeah, like a partisan in this or those hexes, because I would be furious. 
if that were the case. Now you cannot move, so that's nice. You can diminish this pocket quickly enough. And we should have no longer... We should no longer be threatened by what happens in Vyazma. Good, good, good. I think that's going to be it. So let's take a look at our purchase capabilities. V tanks would be nice, but I still need some support. And support like that also will work. Although, however, I need to also preserve some stuff. But this will deploy in December. Let's save some money for HQs. As we are already struggling slowly with the amount of units that we have available. Now that will work wonders at some stage. Do we have guarded the positions? Mm. Semi semi so. And send you, let's actually send you to guard Tirana. They are going to redeploy in Kiev itself. And I will save those MPPs. We don't have anything to buy as in terms of research, yeah. Yeah. It's going. It's going strong. We have the paratrooper. Speaking of it, we should also think about deploying him properly in the achieve some breakthroughs, perhaps. Moscow might be a good direction, just in terms of taking some hexes, but not not now. A bit too early for that, let's do that. Do I want to prepare him immediately? Probably not. Actually, because I don't want to prepare him immediately, I will just reinforce him first. Then I will upgrade him and then I will send him and prepare him once we regain supply in some better locations to strike from. Sounds about right. Next, go south. Army will move to support our units in here. You will be tracked next turn, most likely. But you will retreat. <laughs> yeah. As we advance into Stalingrad area. So close, yet so far. So might say, two hexes, four hexes. Three hexes, actually, if you consider this tank. Yeah, but still a lot of land to cover. Persia might be liberated. One goal of liberating Persia is to actually acquire some garrisons from Persia. But we'll see how that will turn out in the end. Of course, I wonder what's going on here. Maybe we'll spot something with the fighter. And we'll reinforce you, upgrade you and send you when you need to go. To support our offensive against Leningrad. To finish it off once and for all. Soon we should achieve the second piff. well people of experience, hopefully. You're getting there, not so strong. You're doing good, 
I'm going to just elite, put an elite on you, maybe even upgrade you, because that's a risk. Elites and just move on with the life. And we wait for supply, if I recall correctly. Four, three, two, one, yeah. We cannot move further. Just gaining those two supply in here would be va pretty valuable. But yeah. We've got plenty of MPPs with Italians this turn, however. So we need to cover some grounds now. Another fighter might be useful. Of course, strategic bomber as well. Battleship buying it now. I don't think we need to buy it now. We probably need more units currently, still. So, I'm going to do, go for something that will actually give us value. That will be useful to demolish supply of the landing forces. So, let's go for that. First, and then we'll go for fighters. And after this is done, once and for all, we'll go for logistics, because my HQs cannot support that many units for HQs. Can only support so many units. We don't have them. We need more. Not sufficient number. At current stage. Plenty of nice HQs around Skov area. Estonia will be liberated next then. I truly do believe that. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. Let's move him here. With the armor train and Narva inside. Who knows? This tank may be a threat to us. High level threat. But still. They shouldn't be able to touch us quite easily in this hex. With army being present. That's so far working wonders. Maybe not wonders, but it's not bad. If we were to able to take Kauga, we could use this as another hub for HQ. But first we have to deal with that nonsense. And those guys will hel help us achieving that goal. We'll just leave one of those in Voronezh. Proper. Yeah. Wow, Soviets finally begin to suffer. Look at that. Took them long enough. In terms of numbers, at least. And in terms of MPPs, how was this then? Pretty nice. Pretty nice. Now, my cop, we are going to take it never, no matter what happens in this town. And we'll proceed, 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 proceed. Those locations also would be valuable to take, just to deny the threat of someone jumping onto us randomly. You should reattach. So we should be good. And let's push those guys so we can operate him to Morozo Morozovsk. Yeah. That would be welcome. But aside from that, we are good. I'm just wondering whether I should invest into those, but probably not. Battleship Light Cruiser. It's kind of meh. Comparison. Maybe Battleship at Fighters, of course. We need to go for them. We'll need them if we are to invade England. But for now that's going to be it. So far the sky is clear. May maybe not. The sea is clear. From the enemy presence. I hope it will remain that way. We, we have guarded the positions on the coast. The important ones. The threat to national morale has been diminished. We'll need to 
garrisons in around here to secure positions that are threatened we need one in Belgrade and one somewhere next to the mine but they will come the Finnish units and we'll continue our advance into the heartland of the enemy now tanks will be most useful in the south because marshes well they are not good places to fight with tanks and most likely we will just operate it of scoof I think that sounds right we don't have really a place to attack it from here to Wuga and then cut off them from Leningrad Axis so they re the railway had been returned it seems to Wielkiewuki so they will probably attack once more in the nearby future knowing the Germans and the AI Okay, but that's going to be it for now. Thank you once more for watching. I'm still wondering about this artillery piece. Should I? Should I not? Technically, you can buy an HQ next turn, so... Let's buy it like that. I'm going to do it. We will need some help. One way or another, but... For now, that's going to be it. Thank you once more for watching and I will see you next time.